So today I'm going to be unboxing my Victoria's Secret order. I'm really excited about this because I picked out a lot of cute stuff and was able to save over $100 on my order between coupons and sales. However, my package came to me a little suspicious looking. This is what it looked like when it turned up at the door. But it's all duct taped up. So not only was it duct taped up, but my name was misspelled and on a handwritten label on the front of it. So odd. I know it's Victoria's Secret because it says it right there. But what is this packaging right now? Like, especially this part. I'm like concerned with opening this. Oh no. I swear. It's always something, baby. Like, I feel like we have to check on the app and make sure that this is actually our package first. So I was able to log into the app after a few failed face IDs and verify that yes, this is in fact my order. All right, we're gonna cut it with scissors. I'm seriously like stressed out. So everything came as expected in my order, with the exception of one pair of underwear. And I was able to get my coupon for next time. So now let's get to the good stuff, because I'm pretty pumped about this order. I feel like I got a good selection of their products. So let's start first with the new body splash that I got in Gumdrop the Beat. I'm not really sure how I feel about this fragrance yet, but uh, I guess it'll be a time will tell. I also got myself a few new pairs of high-waisted panties in uh, different lace patterns as well as solids. And I definitely couldn't pass up these uh, Clarence Spooky Halloween underwear as well. So these are the high-waisted plain seamless black that I thought went really nice with this top. This to me is good casual stay-at-home clothes for sure. This top looks bigger than I thought, but I think it's going to work just fine. My favorite thing that I got in this order is this pair of joggers, which is zebra print. Uh, they are so cute, so soft. They have the Victoria's Secret logo on the waistband, as well as cute pockets on the side. So a must for sure. I'm not too keen on this bag, but this was a gift with purchase, so we'll see how I feel about it later. And then I also made sure to get new Bath & Body stuff. So I got the Body BFFs, Coco Zen, uh, Body Oil, and Body Wash. So I can't wait to try those. I'm a big coconut fan. It always makes me feel so beachy. So this year, like last year, I'm trying to stick with the bralette or braless. So I got myself a new bralette. These will also go good with the black high-waisted thong. I did also get myself two different rompers, a short sleeve and a long sleeve one, to give these a try so me and the baby can both, I guess, be wearing onesies. And of course I couldn't resist getting a new pair of the original Victoria's Secret leggings. These ones come with pockets this time too, which is a bonus. So instead of the missing item of the Christmas panties, they sent me these black ones instead, which go nice with this bra. From my new favorite set that I got, uh, with an unlined bra and a seamless panty. So needless to say, I'm glad I didn't throw my suspicious package out, and I'm happy with my Victoria's Secret order this time. Thanks for watching!